Happy story there and something to make us smile when we look at the days to come, Ted. It's a, a very perilous thing to be in a tree in this weather. <laughs> very, very windy out there, Jess. Its gusts are unreal. Uh, beyond 45 miles per hour at times, uh, Mesa City just moments ago had a 52 mile per hour gust. And we have choppy waves and Lake Pepin. Uh, boy, a very, very blustery, very prototypical late April day. A lot of wind. The temperatures are not exactly where you expect them to be. Maybe just a little cooler than average, but uh, it's April that happens. We're looking outside with our Lewiston Auto camera from uh, Rochester, or rather from Lake Pepin right now. In Rochester, we have a wind advisory. Areas south and west in that advisory until 7 o'clock this evening. Gusts to 45 miles per hour. As I said, some spots have hit 50 miles per hour. Clouds slow to erode. Eventually, we're going to see some partial clearing, then more and more of that sunshine as the system moves on to the east. Still some sprinkles going on. Some activity around Nodine, around uh, Winona, down toward Caledonia. So some sprinkles in some spots for the short term term, but this little wave of activity will move on through in the next uh, two or three hours and then we'll break out into more and more of that sunshine, dry things out and eventually after sunset, the winds will finally die down. But until then, it's going to be rather raw and rather chilly, a rather raw wind out there. 48 right now. The temperature feels cooler. We throw in that wind. It feels like 40 uh, in Rochester right now. Air pressure rising 29.86 inches of mercury. So gray skies. Eventually there will be a little sun and that will help us get well into the 50s. It is already in the 50s. The West, a little more sun trying to help the cause in Austin. Same deal in Mesa City where it's especially Especially windy, 55 the temperature there. Uh, Albert Lee now uh, 50. And to the west outside the cloud shield of the system, you see where things have warmed up a lot more. This is what's headed our way for tomorrow. We get rid of the storm system. Less wind and more sun looks better. And already Sioux Falls, for instance, 62 right now. Sioux City agrees with that, and Omaha now 63. So we do have some better weather ahead. Windy and cool though today. A couple sprinkles to the east, then pleasant weather Thursday, and small chances of rain for parts of the area. Friday and Saturday. The vast majority of the area looks pretty good. We'll enjoy some mild sunshine. Today is some sun, but the very tail end of the day, wind's still pretty rough all the way through sunset. Uh, 50, 60 expected high, dropping into the low 40s. And in fact, by tomorrow morning, right around 39, one of the cooler mornings we will have had, but at least the winds will not be as much a problem tomorrow. Here's future track watching. Storm system move out of here. Sprinkles for the short term by around 4 or 5 o'clock. We'll at least see a fair amount of sunshine. Still a powerful breeze. Wind advisory expires at 7, and even beyond that, still pretty blustery with those 25 mile per winds. Uh, winds really drop off after midnight. We'll have lows in the upper 30s. Sunshine tomorrow. Still kind of a cool breeze around 10 to 15 miles per hour, but high temperatures mid 60s rather. Uh, we'll be in the 70s by the weekend, but the 60s tomorrow, upper 60s Friday. Watch this little storm system to the northwest. It brings a couple of showers in our general direction. We may have a brief shower for parts of Friday. So we'll look at future track uh, next couple of days. Uh, today in the 50s, dropping to the upper 30s tonight, and then tomorrow heading into uh, the afternoon hours. Plenty of sunshine looking at 60s tomorrow on Friday. A little line of, of brief shower activity comes in for the middle part of the day. Then we'll break out into full sun beyond that. And later today on Friday, look for uh, some sun in upper 60s and low 70s will be the story on Saturday. That looks to be the warmest of the next several days. We cool off a little bit next week with some rain chances uh, uh, by late Monday into Tuesday. So 60 in Zambroda today. Austin 61, North Iowa, similar situation, especially westward where there's more sun. Mason City 61 and Lake Mills around 61 as well. Rochester 56, but sprinkles to the east, gradual clearing and gusty north winds up to 40 to 50 miles per hour. 39 tonight, a diminishing breeze, mainly clear. And tomorrow, 64, sunny skies, a cool north breeze. Seven day forecast again, looking at 60s and 70s. A better chance of rain, though. Oh, we could use some of that, so that'll be a good thing, but we'll hold it off until after the weekend early next week, Jess. Oh, sun, tomorrow's sun's going to be great. Yeah, I'm excited about the lack of wind. <laughs> that'd be nice.